Yahweh's jealous for me. Love's like a hurricane. I am a tree bending beneath the weight of his wind and mercy. When all of a sudden I am unaware of these eclipses, eclipsed by glory, and I realize just how beautiful you are and how great your affections are for me. Oh, how he loves us so. like a hurricane I am a tree bending beneath the weight of his wind and mercy when all of a sudden I am unaware of these afflictions eclipsed by glory and I realize just how beautiful you are Praise Yahweh again. Is Yahweh good? Is Yahweh good? Glory be to Yahweh. And at this time, saints, let us all remain standing. Let us all have a word of prayer. Let us all bow our heads and lift our voices unto Yahweh. Heavenly Father, Yahweh, we come before you through your son's name, Yahshua, the Messiah. You are the God who created the heavens and the earth and created us from the dust and back to the dust we must go. Lord Yahweh, we thank you for another day that was not promised unto us. We thank you for allowing us to enter through your gates with thanksgiving. And Lord Yahweh, we ask that you continue to teach us of your ways, Lord Yahweh. Speak unto our hearts and take anything that is evil out of us, Lord. And help us to continue to press on, Lord Yahweh, even when times get hard, Lord. We thank you for your strength and your encouragement that you give unto us through your words, that we may continue to grow on, Lord Yahweh. 
and to grow in the spirit and in all knowledge, Lord Yahweh, yes, which we thank you for your wisdom that you have given unto us. And we thank you for your many blessings that you have bestowed upon us. And we thank you, Lord Yahweh, for the men of God that you have set up amongst us, Lord Yahweh, the apostles, the prophets, the evangelists, pastors, and teachers. And we thank you for anointing them with your spirit, Lord Yahweh, and for them to be in our examples, Lord. And we thank you, Lord Yahweh, for them. And we ask that you continue to speak through them, Lord Yahweh, tonight, whoever you may choose to speak through, that you give them the words, your words, Lord Yahweh, to speak unto us that we apply them to our lives, Lord Yahweh, and take them in and give a most earnest heed to what's about to come forth. And Yahweh, we ask that you bless the mouth of the reader also, Lord, that you give him the words and, and the mind to go along with the minister, Lord, that your word may have free course in our lives. We ask that you look down upon those that are sick and afflicted tonight, that you touch them and heal them, Lord Yahweh, and for those that haven't made it into your house, that you make a safe way for them. And let me assure the Messiah that the church say, Amen. I'd like to read a scripture out of Psalms 103. Bless Yahweh, O my soul, and all that is within me, bless his holy name. Bless Yahweh, O my soul. Yes. And forget not all his benefits, who forgiveth all thy iniquities, who healeth all thy disease, who redeemeth thy life from destruction, who crowneth thee with loving kindness and tender mercies, who satisfieth thy mouth with good things, so that thy youth is renewed like the eagles. O Yahweh executed righteousness and judgment for all those oppressed. He made known his ways unto Moses. His acts unto the children of Israel. Amen. Praise Yahweh, saints. Amen. Praise Yahweh. Amen. It's a good night to be here in his presence tonight. Thanking Yahweh. Excuse me, I'm a little under the weather tonight, but I had to go ahead and press my, my, my way on because I know that healing is here in his house. Hallelujah. Praise Yahweh, saints. If I can go and give eight hours unto, you know, a natural thing, my job, I can come and give two or three hours under Yahweh tonight and hear his words. Amen. But I thank Yahweh for my family. I thank Yahweh for everything that has given unto me. But I'm not going to prolong the time. we got to get ready to hear what Yahweh has to say unto us. So at this time, please stand and rise and receive Teacher Davis by saying praise Yahweh. I praise Yahweh, saints. Praise Yahweh. You can be seated. We thank Yahweh for allowing us to be here today. Once again, in this house that is called by his name. We thank Yahweh for having us have the mind to come into his house this day. We could be anywhere right now. Hallelujah. We see many people that are driving up and down the highways. Many people are at home right now. But I know we, you know, I feel blessed to be part of the upright. Hallelujah. You know, I feel blessed to be able to come into Yahweh's house. I know that in this, in this race we're on, we are fighting against Satan. We are fighting against spiritual wickedness in high places. And I know that I have to come to this place to, to arm myself to be able to withstand the, the Satan and all his devices that he that he tries to use on us all day long. But I thank Yahweh for my wife, for my children he's given unto me. Hallelujah. I thank Yahweh for all of you that continue to press your way out to the house of God. I know that it's a sacrifice. I know it's a sacrifice we all make. Yes, Hallelujah. Amen. But the good thing is that it's not in vain. Amen. 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 You come in here ready to hear, then it's not in vain. So saints, let's get our Bibles out. Let's get ready to follow along with what Yahweh is going to speak unto us tonight. We know that you've been praying things that would happen in your life. Yes, but when you come here, that's when you get your answer. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, you know, time and time again, we can come here. And if you don't have the right mind, you, you'll, sit, you'll sit through service and you'll walk out feeling the same way before. If you, if you were discouraged Hallelujah. before, you'll walk out discouraged. Amen. But the fact is, you were answered when you came here. Yes, Hallelujah. Amen. So, saints, we know that. Yahweh always does the speaking in this place. We know that we don't preach ourselves, but we preach Yahshua, 
the Messiah and him crucified. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So it saints at this time, Apostle, at this time, let everyone please stand and rise. Let's receive our beloved Apostle Washington by saying praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh, praise Yahweh saints. Everyone can be seated. Amen. We want to thank the Almighty for blessing us to be back here in the house once again Amen. that is called by his name. We thank him for his goodness and for the, his, his mercy, the multitude of his tender mercy. Yes, I would rather say it like that. Yes, Amen. That he has shared upon us abundantly and we are so grateful. Amen. This evening to, to know him and, mm -hmm. and to be taught by him. Amen. And we thank him for his holy calling that how that he called us out of darkness into his marvelous light. Mm -hmm. And it's a great thing. <clears throat> to be part of this ministry and it's important that we should walk like we uh we do appreciate amen, amen the salvation that he bestowed upon us amen. this salvation is is for is for every man but every man do not have an ear amen to hear amen. neither amen. do every man have a heart amen to to receive uh, his testimonies his commandments hallelujah and his commandments, as Yeshua said, that he testified that his father's commandments are not grievous. Amen. And it's not. Anyone in their right mind who, uh, who may be on a boat, a ship, and the ship is sinking, mm -hmm. anyone in their right mind would want to get off the ship. Amen. And they have smaller boats. They call life raft yeah. boats. And... You're supposed to leave the ship and get on the boat. Amen. And, it, uh, and uh, so anyone in their right mind know that when a ship is sinking, you find your, your life jacket and, and you hit towards the area that they have set up for you. Hallelujah. And so you can evacuate the boat and get on something that's going to that's gonna save you. Amen. Well, see, everyone will have the kind of mind to want to save themselves. The, the world is, is drowning in sin. The world do not know the will of God. The world and every man that's in the world do not have an ear to receive his to to receive his words, nor to hear his voice when he hear it. Amen. And so, but we want the blessed ones out of so many men Hallelujah. and women of the world who have heard the truth when we receive when we heard it and Amen. we receive the truth. Hallelujah. This time I want to send greetings to Mother Mary in San Antonio. Yeah, we encourage you to keep the faith, be strong, and continue the faith. And we we'll also send also greetings to those in, in Lubbock who are continue to listen to what we have to say. And we also encourage you to do the same. Amen. You save yourself and don't wait on nobody else. This is a save yourself situation. Yes, and you'll do well if you take heed. Amen. And uh, you see, because every man do not have an ear to hear. Amen. Every one do not have a heart to want to understand. Amen. And so if you can receive this thing, and you will humble yourself and accept it. It'll save you. Amen. Amen. So we, Amen. And I'm grateful for that. Uh, I'm thankful this, the night I can say that I have an ear to hear. Hallelujah. But I want to call your attention to the book of Matthew, the seventh chapter. And we thank Yahweh for Yeshua, the Messiah that he has sent into the world. Amen. To show us how we ought to walk and how we should please God. Hallelujah. But in Matthew, the seventh chapter, as Yeshua was speaking here to his disciples, yeah, yeah. Um, the Messiah, in the beginning of his message, as soon as he began to open his mouth up and preach the gospel, the will of his father, immediately there were, he was met with men, men who claimed to be servants of God, preachers of God, prophets of God. And immediately he was met with them, and right off they begin to, to blaspheme and to contradict Hallelujah. the things that he was teaching. Amen. And so I, 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 I want you to understand that men haven't changed. Amen. 2,000 years ago, the Lord spoke the truth. He came into the world. Amen. And his first message was to those that would hear him was for them to repent and believe the gospel. Amen. Not, not to try to understand it because this thing is too, amen, it's too, it's too holy 
to understand it Hallelujah. right off from the beginning because we you see we all are currently minded people yeah. we all are born in sin and we all are shaped in iniquity Amen. we all have risen up with grandpa doctrine and grandma doctrine and Amen. what we the, what the principal taught us and our neighbor taught us and all of this we allow Hollywood to teach us, amen, how we ought to be. So by the time the Holy Ghost make it to us, by the time the Spirit get to us, our life is so messed up, and we have all sorts of teaching in our hearts. So, amen, right off is, is our nature, amen, to reject the truth when we hear it. Amen. And so it didn't surprise me, since I know the truth now, it doesn't surprise me that, in the days of the Messiah and the apostles, you had men that would rise up against the truth that was spoken. And so that has, hasn't changed at all. Men still do the same thing. Amen. They will still fight the truth when they Hallelujah. hear it. Hallelujah. But Yahshua began to say here to his disciples Amen. in the 13th chapter, the 13th verse of the 7th chapter of Matthew. Amen. Yes, sir. What did he say? Matthew 7 and 13. Uh huh. It is written. Yes. Enter ye in and Now, a because he loved the saints, he loved those, his disciples, so much. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He began to instruct them to, to find the courage that they need to enter in to follow the straight gate. Yes, Lord. Although it's not favorable with everybody, it's not going to be favorable with everybody in your house. It's not going to be favorable with, with your kin folks. Amen. It, it won't be favorable in the eyes of your city that you may live in. But that's the gate that you should enter. Amen. So he said, enter ye in at the straight gate. For why did Because the, the way to hell is wide. That gate is wide, he said. Amen. It is wide. The gate, the way to hell, he said. That gate, the door to that gate is wide. And broad is the and way. And that way to hell is so broad. And the reason why it's broad because men have so many ideals. Yes, we Amen. have so many thoughts. You see, we have our own righteousness. Yes, Lord. That's why, have you, that's why it's hard to try to convert a gay man. Mm -hmm. Amen. You, 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 have, you, know, you have just as much as, as a, a difficult time trying to convert somebody gay than you're trying to convert somebody that is prejudiced. Amen. The wrong spirit is just the wrong spirit, Amen. regardless of what the spirit is. Amen. And so, and because you have, though, you know, and we live in a time where society begins to accept that mess. Yes. They want to condone uh, 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 same sex marriages and all that. Amen. People don't want to talk about it no more. They don't want to. They don't want to speak about it. You know, Amen. They figure if you speak about it, you're criticizing people. Yeah. But we don't criticize nobody. We just speak the truth. Amen. Our job is to speak the truth. When Yeshua came on the scene, he spoke the truth. He didn't criticize nobody. He, his word was, I came not into the world to condemn the world. See, amen. That's amen. not what he come to do. He no. said, I come to save the save. world. The, the world's already condemned. Yeah. We was condemned, amen, already. before he came. So his purpose was to come. Amen. And to save us from the condemnation that we was in. Amen. And this condemnation is the sin. You know, our ideals, the thing that we think is right. Hallelujah. The thing that we think we have no problem with. That's because right. you don't have a problem with it, don't make it right. Amen. If heaven have a problem with it, then that's a problem. Amen. And so God, God has a way to solve that problem. He got one way to solve it here, and that's in his son, Yeshua Messiah, if we yeah. believe on him. Amen. Then he got another way to solve it when the thing is over with. Amen. When every man has to stand before him and be judged and give an account of, 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 of his deed mm -hmm. that he done in the, in the flesh. And he said, the Lord said, whether it be good and evil. So you have to give an account of everything you do. Amen. So, so Yeshua wanted his disciples to know yes. it's important for you to enter in at the straight gate. For wide is the gate. Because wide is the gate. And broad is the way. The way to hell is wide and it is broad. Amen. Uh-huh. That leadeth to destruction. And then where does it go? To destruction. No, it go to heaven. To destruction. No, if you follow that wide gate, because that's where most of the people are at. You find most of the people at the wide gate. To destruction. And it, it leads you where? To destruction. And you can't run with everybody. No. Sometimes you have to run by yourself. That's why I thank y'all for Mother Mary. She's down in San Antonio, but she's running by herself. 
You, see, you might have one person up in love and may have to run by herself. Amen. Hallelujah. But Amen. if that's what you have to do, that's just what you have to do. But you don't want to follow the majority of mankind. No. Right. Hallelujah. Amen. The majority of mankind will agree to a lie quick. Yes. Because men love lies. Yes. Amen. Amen. Now watch the Lord and read it. Enter ye in the straight gate. Enter ye in at the straight gate. For wide is the gate. Because wide is and the broad gate. Is the way. Wide is the gate and broad is the way. That leadeth to destruction. That lead where? To destruction. When it's all said and done. Yes. A lot of folks going they're going to wish to God yes. that they would have the faith they need to have, you know, to have believed the gospel. Yes. And so you don't want to follow that gate where everybody else is following. No. That's why you don't, you know, you then in love, but you don't know many women like, like Sister Sylvia. Amen. That testify, amen, how she, amen, she waiting on her husband to come yeah. back home. Amen. There's not many women like that in earth. Hmm? There's not many men that, that's like that in earth, testifying how they're waiting for their wife to come back, how they're willing to forgive them. You can't get the world to testify like that. Amen. Matter of fact, the world don't even think we exist until they come in our presence. And after we begin to open our mouth and testify, and then they'd be amazed at our faith and our belief. Amen. Because, amen, our conversation is not of this earth. No. It's in heaven. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And the world can't get this because it's, it's foolish to them. Amen. They can't get it because it's foolish. And, that, and so our, our message is different than everybody else's message. Hallelujah. Hey Amen. Everywhere Amen. Every, there's, there's, not, there's not a place you can go to on this planet. You, yeah, you'll find a, a building to have a church on there. But just because it's a church don't mean the truth is preached in there. Amen. Neither does it mean the standard of our Lord is being lifted. lifted. Hallelujah. So that's why our message is so different. Uh, even I was astonished when I first heard it. This thing, hey man, the Bible talked about when Yeshua preached and the Pharisee, when they heard him preach, they said they were astonished out, out of measure. measure. This thing will mess you up. Yes, it will. It, uh, when you hear the truth, it'll just mess you up. And it, it just puts you all out of measure. You don't know, way, hey man, what to say, what to do, what to get mad, run, or whatever. Because the truth is the truth. It takes sleep away from you. You can't go to sleep. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So if you don't have no peace in San Antonio and love it because this thing, it'll stir you up like that. And it won't leave you alone until you line up. Yes. That's how it is here. Yes. Amen. This thing will take peace from you. If you contrary to what the Spirit is saying to the church, you can't rest till you get it right. Amen. You can't rest till you get it right. Hallelujah. You can't rest till you humble yourself. Are you, are you listening to me? Hallelujah. Go to Corinthians right quick. Corinthians 2, I believe that's why I want you to go. 1 Corinthians 2. Amen. Listen to Pastor Paul here writing to the, now the Corinthian church, the believers in Corinth, and they was also astonished at, at Paul teaching. Amen. But I want you to look at this verse here. Yes, sir. Corinthians 2. 1 Corinthians 2 and 1. Paul writing to the church in, in, that was in Corinth. Yes. Come on, read it. It is written. Uh-huh. And I, brethren. And I, brethren. When I came to you. When I first come to you. Came not with excellency I didn't come talking speech, like all them other preachers you've been listening to over, over wisdom. years. Amen. When I come to you, said I, Paul, said, I didn't come to you with that, with that same message you've been listening to all your life. Amen. Our speech is not excellent. No. Amen. We don't sit down and write something up beautiful for you. Hey, man, we don't do that. That's not, we don't, we usually say, oh, this would this be a wonderful message. No. Yeah, this would be a wonderful message. <laughs> you know, I was just, I just, you know, let's just talk about this over here. We, we're not like that. The message that we have, hey, amen, is going to offend you. Amen. It's going to shake you up. Yes. That's what it's supposed to do. The truth yes. will shake you up. Because if you're not right, you need shaking. Yes, Lord. Thank you always that I, the Spirit shook me up. Spirit, they spoke to the prophets, told him, and God instructed us through the prophet that we should break up that folly ground. Hallelujah. Amen. You got to break the ground. It's messed up. And so we got to break the ground up. And, amen. And then allow the word to come in. And you need to, a, a heart of flesh where the Spirit can, can deal with you. And you don't want a heart of stone when you hear the word right off. You shut, shut off. And say, I, don't, I don't believe like that. When, you, when it's in your Bible, you're supposed to believe like that. Hallelujah. So watch Paul. He'll read it. And I, brethren, and I, brethren when I came to you, when I came to you, came not with excellency and y'all know that's the truth. You know that's the truth. 
Yeah. When we come to you in San Antonio, when we come to Lubbock, we didn't come down there with excellent speech. Or of wisdom. If we had an excellent speech, the place would have been filled. Amen. But right. folks know what we, they know what we're all about. And they don't want to show up because we're going to deal with sin. We're going to deal with sin. And so, hey, amen, if the speech is excellent, I tell you, Billy Graham would showed up in Lubbock. Hey, that the place would have been filled. Filled up. T.D. Jake would have showed up in San Antonio. The place would be filled. But here, hey man, our speech is not excellent. In other words, it's not what the world wants. You'd be sitting in church mad. How can you be mad in the church? Because the speech is not excellent. It's not what the world accepts. It's not what the world, you know, they don't put no proof on the truth. So he said, I came not with excellent speech of man wisdom. Declaring unto you. Not with man wisdom. Amen. I didn't come to you with man wisdom. Amen. I'm not, I, I'm not, I, but Paul said, I didn't come to you with what man think you ought to do. Amen. To make you feel, feel good about yourself. Mm -hmm. When I first, I said before, and I used myself as a testimony, and I used my own self, my own testimony to tell you about how I felt when I first made it to the church. Amen. I heard, I said before, I heard words like I never heard before. I haven't changed that testimony. It's still the same. I, I heard words like I never heard before. And I got so angry. Because the word I heard showed me my sin. Yes. It showed me the wrong that I was doing. And that's why, and that's why I, I, I felt the way I felt. I said I'd never come back. I'd never go back to that church again. But Yahweh was merciful. Yes, he was. He was merciful because he, as Paul said, and Paul said, I did it in ignorance. Yep. I was very ignorant about what I said. Hallelujah. If anybody in that right mind want to be in the church where the truth is being preached, yes. where a standard is being lifted, yes. so that's where you're going to be saved at. Hallelujah. You don't want to be, you, you don't want to, you don't want to be part of something that ain't real. You know it's not real. They cut you out sooner. You, the preacher will cut you out. You make them mad enough. Hallelujah. Yeah, folks in the church chunking ch chairs at each other if you make them mad enough. Amen. Yes, you will, too. It'll be like Jerry Springer. <laughs> in the church. In the church. Folks in the church cussing one I'm telling you, that's what, that's what you got out there. Amen. You got a, a, a lot of folks out there go to church, and all they have is just a form of godliness. Yeah, yeah. you'll get a shout, but you may get a cuss, too. Yeah. You may get you may get someone crying, call yourself crying for Jesus. They next know they crying because they did it wrong. Amen. <laughs> so so Paul said, Amen. So when I came unto you, I came not with excellent speech of man wisdom, declaring unto you the testimony the what, of God. The what? The testimony so Paul said, of God. I, I didn't come to you, Amen. What I thought, yeah, and what I think is right. Paul, that's what Paul said. I didn't come to you with what I, what I, what I, what I, this is how my mama grew, this is how I grew up, this is what yeah. my mother taught me, this is what my dad put in me, this, this is what my no. grandfather said, you know, Just you know, in my neighborhood, this is how we believe. No. <laughs> Church I go to, this is how we grew up, and this is how it was told us, this is all I ever known. No. Paul said, I didn't come to you with excellent speech of man no. wisdom. He said, Declare and declare unto you the testimony. testimony of God. Paul said, I didn't come to you with my thought. No. I'm, I'm delivering to you his testimony. Yes. What he said. Yes. Not, 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 not what you think about, he said. Not how you feel about what he what you you know what he may have said, but I'm telling you what he said. Yes. And you can't go everywhere. Well, uh, uh, the preacher's going to stand before you and tell you what he said. That's right. Amen. That's why many churches we go to, we're not welcome back. Because we're going to tell you what he said. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have to tell you what he said about the situation. Yes. And whatever you need to know is contained there in the scripture. The scripture said, what's everything that was written aforetime, amen, that which means before we come along. Yes. There are those that believed on the Lord before we did. I never walked with the Lord. No. There's not a man today ever walked with the Lord. They don't know what he looked like. They can't. They, they, they try to describe what he looked like. And they have their parents show, put their finger at a picture they may have on their living room wall. But that's not him. No. 
it for? No, it is not. <laughs> Yes, yes, right. Why, 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 why all the saints got to have blue eyes? <laughs> why the eyes can't be? Why, 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 I mean, yeah. Anyway. Who said it had to be blue? Because it could have been brown. We don't know. And why do you got to be that, that, that light skinned? Could, could it have been just a little dog? <laughs> but that's how you grew up, though, see. Yeah, could it have been just a little dog? I mean, could it look like he came from the Middle East? And not from Europe. I mean, can't at least make him look like he came from the Middle East and not from Europe? From Crete? <laughs> at least. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes. So he said, what there again? Uh, and I, brethren. And I, brethren. When I came to you. When I came to you. Came not with I came not with the excellent speech. Or of wisdom. Or of wisdom. Declaring unto you the testimony of God. Declaring unto you the testimony of God. That's what we we. The message we have is the testimony of God. Amen. We, we can cut the AC off. Yes. But we declare the testimony of God. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Everything we everything you ever heard us say is the testimony of God. Amen. And you can always tell the testimony of God because man immediately rejects it. You know, Hallelujah. We don't we don't want it. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We say you cannot divorce mm -hmm. your companion. Right. Amen. Have to be only for the cause of fornication. That's his testimony. I yes. didn't. I didn't. I didn't say that. He said that. He did. I'm not that good. I mean, <laughs> I know I used to steal and stuff in the world. I can be very clever, but how did I get over to your house and write that in your book and write in everybody else's book? I don't have the power of Santa Claus, <laughs> who can show up in everybody's house with all yeah. the gifts, and he don't have it either. For claim that he had. It. Amen. But see, we know the truth. Your mom and daddy snuck that under that tree. Yeah. And wrote Santa Claus. That's the truth about the matter. <laughs> and only your tree. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So when we tell you, amen, what we teach about divorce, and that's why, that's why Sister Sylvia, that's why she keeping herself pure. Because she knows that in order to be saved, she can't have another man in her that's life. That's right. I remember the day when she first came here. She come with somebody, Steve, I think his name was Steve, who she, who she was at that time calling him husband, and he was calling her a wife, yeah. if I'm not mistaken, but he, he came. They both heard the same message. But see, with Steve, they had the right kind of heart to say, well, you know, we are in adultery. And you got to learn to call it what it is, because that's just what it was. But he he yeah, yeah, he, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. He thought he knew Greek and all that, cause he knew a few Greek words. They don't Greek. The Greek can't get around the word. This the truth hold the Greeks. It hold the Greeks. And so, it made, so the, the the difference between Sister Sylvia and him was that Sister Sylvia had a pure heart. She wanted to do the right thing, yes. and it was it was shown in her action. She heard the word. She believed it, and she looked at him and said, we can't be together no more because that's what the word says. That's what my Bible says, and that's what your Bible says. That's right. Hallelujah. So as much as he didn't like it, he got upset, ran off. But you see, but she's still here, continuing in the faith that was once delivered unto the saints. That's what she's continuing to walk in. In that faith that was once delivered unto the saints. Amen. That faith ne has never changed. Now, men have changed it, but it never, have never, has never been changed in the eyes of the Most High God. Hallelujah. Are you listening to me? Hallelujah. Are you listening to me? Yes, Lord. And that's the message that we have. Yes. It's the testimony of Yeshua. That's right. What he taught. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What it says there. For I determined. For I am determined. Not to know Paul anything Paul said, I ain't nobody going to shake me. Yeah. You're not going to shake me from Amen. this. You're not going to shake me from this here. Amen. I don't want to know what you found on the internet. That's right. That's right. No. I don't know. I don't want to know what, about the dream you had. Like, if it's going to change the truth, I don't want to know about it. Because right. right. I don't want to know anything. No. Only thing I want to know is, 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 is his resurrection. Yes. That's the only thing I want to know is, is he living in you? Yes. 
That's all I want to know. I don't want to know. I care less about it. Amen. How you pay your tithe. That's right. I don't care how good you can sing your song. Uh, Paul, yeah. I don't care nothing. Paul said, I care less about all those yes. things. Only thing I want to know is, amen, if with not, he's living in you. Yes, yes sir. For I determined not, to know, determined not to know anything among you. Save Yeshua the Save Messiah. Save Yeshua the Messiah. Him what he taught. Amen. What he delivered unto us. He yes. said, and I don't want to know nothing else. Amen. I don't want to, I don't want to read somebody's book. No. You know, I was at the mall the other day at the bookstore. <laughs> And I came, I came across this book, Is It Right to Divorce? And I bought that book, and it, and it, and, 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 and it said that I can. If your, husband, if your husband cheat on you, you can, you can divorce him and go marry somebody else. I bought that. You, you need to, can I send you that book, Apostle Washington? No, you can't send me that book. Amen. Well, I'm going to send it to you anyhow. Well, I'm going to return it back to you. Right. Because I don't want to hear. I care less about what some man say. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On the, on, I want to hear the Yeshua testimony. Yes. What did he say about it? Yes. Amen. Amen. Tell me what the, I want, I want, is, is, is that the apostles teach it? Because he, he, amen, he delivered this, this, this message to them and instructed them, commissioned them to go into all the world. And to preach the gospel to every creature. Hallelujah. He said, I want you to teach them everything that I taught you. That's yes. the only thing I want to hear. Yes. That's the only thing I want to know is his testimony. Yes. And his testimony is, amen, whosoever shall put away his wife except for the cause of fornication. Not adultery. Fornication. Yes. And marriage another commits adultery. That's his testimony. Yes, it is. And whosoever married her that is, is put, put away. away, someone else don't want her, but also. you do, and you took her, you, you took her to be your wife. He said, do it also. Now, that's his testimony. I can't run with nothing else. I don't want to know nothing else. I don't want to know nothing else. Don't mention to me other folks in the Bible. Don't mention to me about David. I don't care about David. David's testimony is not going to help you. Not when it comes to marriage. That's right. But David do have a testimony that you can't run to. He said, The Lord said unto my Lord, Sit thou on my right hand until I make thy enemy thy footstool. Well, you can run with that because now David, Lord, is talking now. Amen. David have a Lord going to be talking to everybody, all other lords on what we should do. And that's why Yeshua is Lord of Lords. Yes. And that's why he's King of Kings. Yes. Are you listening to me? Yes, Lord. So only testimony I want to hear is your shoe. Yes. That's the only thing I want to know. Do you want to be saved? Yes. Well, if you want to be saved, this is the message. Yes. Come on, read it. And I was with you. And I was with you. In weakness. Listen to Paul. Paul, I knew you didn't understand. When I first come to you, you didn't understand. I knew, I knew you didn't understand. Yes. And I was with you in weakness. And in fear. And even when you was afraid. Sometime when you first come on this journey, till you get this thing in you, you're afraid to stand up. Amen. To do the right thing. Sometimes you can't find the courage you need to stand up and do the right thing. Amen. But Paul said, I was with you. Yes. Even when, they, when you was afraid. Yes. Because Satan, see, he show up. Yes. You know, he'll show you how, you know, he show you all kind of false pictures. Mm -hmm. Mirages and all yeah. this kind of stuff. Yeah. He might be that coyote. You know, trying to, trying to get the road runner. Yeah. And I can tell you, that, that coyote, he can paint up and stuff, can't he? Make it look real and everything else. And that's how the devil is with us. Makes it look real. Especially, with, especially among women. Yeah. Especially, you, you know, all your, you know, you, you marry someone and, and, and you don't work. You know, he does all, you know, he bring all the income in. And Satan show you, amen, how are you going to eat? How are you going to take care of the kids? How are you going to make a living? This is a good man. He show you all this kind of stuff, Amen. and it's called fear. Yes, Amen. it's called fear. Fear kick in. Mm -hmm. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But you gotta watch out for fear. John, it's getting hot. Is that heat on? Okay, cut it back on. Wow. <laughs> but John, it does get hot quick. That was quick. I see why you had it on there. But John spoke about those about the fearful. He saw them in the lake. Yeah. The, the Holy Ghost allowed John to look into the lake and find out who was there. And when right. John looked in the lake, he saw the fearful in the lake also. Yes, he did. 
So Satan, he'll come to you with fear. Yeah. Make you be afraid to stand up and, and, and trust Yahweh. Yeah, trust right. God to his word. If God said it wrong, then you should say it wrong. Yeah. If God said, come out from among them, my people, then you're supposed to come out of it. Yeah. That's what Susan Sylvia did. She came out of came out. She came out of adultery. And you know what? The Lord have always provided for her. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yes. Yes, I read on. And I was with you. And I was with you in weakness. And in fear. And even in fear. And in much trembling. And in much trembling. And my speech. And but my speech. And my preaching. And the thing that I taught. Was not with enticing words. It was not words with enticing words. I know you'll wisdom. get mad real quick. Yeah. Because most men, they try to avoid offending you. Most preachers will come that they they do their best to try to avoid offending you. That's right. Avoid it. Hallelujah. They see your face change. He'll change the mess. Next week he come right. back with a better mess <laughs> to put a smile on your face. Yeah. But Paul said, do I seek to please man or please God? He said, if I seek to please man, then I can't please God. And so that's why we teach like we do. We, 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 yeah, we just spit it out. And if it fend, it's just going to fend. And, 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 uh, you're not the, you, and you won't be the first people that was offended. You won't be the first believer that was Amen. offended. Yeshua preached the gospel so true and so plain. The Pharisees was very upset. Yeah, they was. Now, the apostles, they were just now beginning to believe. and Begin to, you know, what he's saying makes sense. But they kept also looking over at the faces of the Pharisees. <laughs> His own disciples kept yeah. looking at the face of the Pharisee. And saw how it was all, the face all messed up. <laughs> People quiet, ain't saying amen. You know, like they do when they hear the word. Changed. So the disciples come to him and say, Lord, you're going to try to help the Lord with, it, with the message. His own disciples are going to come to him, try to help him with the message, trying to help him, show him how to help save people. And he said, Lord, don't you know that the Pharisee was offended at Joe's teaching. <laughs> the shoe looked at him and said, leave him alone. Leave him alone. So you got to leave people alone. Those that are not going to do the right thing, you got to leave them. You can't drag them with you. You can't drag them with you. You just, just got to leave them. Sometimes you got to leave daddy by himself. Because daddy get offended at the word. Yeah. Sometimes mom get offended at the word. And you just got to just leave mother alone. Because mother take you down with her. Amen. Oh, yeah, because once a person is offended, they're going to try to justify themselves. Yeah. Amen. Why are they what they are and how they are right to be what they are. Yeah. But we, th we, we, we must allow the word to justify us. Hallelujah. So, yes, you would say, you leave them alone. Leave them alone. He said, they, they be blind leaders leave of the blind. blind. They, 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 they be blind leaders of the blind. He also said, look, every plant that my heavenly father have not planted is going to be leave plucked up. So if the Father haven't planted you, this thing gonna root you up. It'll root you up. So you can't wait on everybody else to become believers. The Spirit, the Spirit says, save yourself. From this Peter told him on the day of Pentecost. He said, save yourself from this untoward generation. You can't worry about this generation. If you can see and understand this message and receive it, you want the blessed one. Everyone is not blessed like you. Amen. Everyone that have eyes to see, they will not see. Everyone that have ears to hear, they will not hear. Everyone, because a man have a heart, don't mean he will perceive. He will accept the truth. That's why your shoes said, blessed are your eyes. That they see the thing that they see. There's not many women can see this and say, wait a minute, I'm in adultery. According to the word, I'm in adultery. We can't be together. That's not many men will say, oh, wait a minute, we're, we're, I'm in adultery. According to the scripture, I'm in adultery. We can't be together. We got to separate. That's not many. That's not many like that. That's not many that, that, are, that are honest enough to humble themselves to the truth. Hallelujah. And that's the straight gate. Yeah. Those that won't humble themselves. Hallelujah. 
Watch it, read it. In my speech. In my speech. In my preaching. In my preaching. Was not with enticing words. It was words not with enticing of words. Man's wisdom. It was not with enticing words of man. We don't talk like all other men. Amen. Uh huh. But in demonstration. But it's in demonstration of the spirit. We, we let the spirit operate. And of power. We let the spirit operate, and when it operate, it operate, and I don't operate. It operate with power. Amen. That's why it seems like you, you know you felt sometimes you feel like someone went and told the bishop. You know, all the wrong that you ever did. That's right. Well, that's the power of God. Hallelujah. That's the spirit that is working through the man. Yes. And it's power to shake you. Yes. It'll shake you where you sit. You don't have to be here in Arlington sitting among us. But if you're listening, yeah. this thing will shake you. Yes, it will. It'll shake you. Yeah. Paul said spirit and power. Amen. And the power is there for what reason? Yes. For what reason? That your faith. That your what? Your faith. The reason why the Spirit uses us like it does, because you need to put your, your faith in the right place. Amen. Because you believe. Say, I believe in God. Well, Satan also, but he's still the devil. Scripture says, you believe that there's one God, you do well. But Satan also believes, you know it, but he's he still the do devil. Well. Do you do? See, everyone don't have enough faith to believe that if you don't accept what he teach, you hell bound. It takes faith to believe that. Amen. It takes faith, it takes that kind of faith that when you hear the message, it calls you to change, change your lifestyle. That's right. If you're in sin, you'll come out. Hallelujah. If you're prejudiced, you'll stop it. Stop. You'll start loving everybody like he, like he instructed you to do. If you're mean and hateful, you'll become the most nicest thing that the world have ever seen. If you're selfish, you become giving. This thing will make a new creature out of it. It'll make, that's why the Spirit said you must repent and you have to be born again. You can't come to God like you are. You, we, we, we're too messed up to come to him like we are. So you have to be born again of the Spirit. Yes. Except you be born again of, of the water and of the Spirit. And this, this is his testimony. Yes. You can't see the kingdom of God. The kingdom be right in front of you. You know, some of you in love it. You know, Sister Sylvia, that's the kingdom of God right in front of you. She's displaying the kingdom of heaven. Hallelujah. How you ought to be, how you ought to serve God. That's the kingdom of God. And if you don't have the right spirit, you'll never see this kingdom in her. Hallelujah. Instead of yeah, in your own testimony that she's not the same person. She changed. What I she changed. And you your own testimony with knowledge that. Yeah. Hallelujah. The old civil wouldn't spend no time with none of you. Not the old civil. She wouldn't care. She wouldn't shed a tear for none of you. Y'all didn't get alone. Only reason you get alone now is because of Sylvia. Some of you only, the only, way, the only reason why you get along with her today because, because of her. It's the kingdom of God. Yes. Yeshua told the disciple, the kingdom of God is within you. you. Yes. This thing worked from the inside yes. out. It's not like a lot of church that look good on the outside, but all messed up inside. Yes. They're still the same person they was before they got dressed and went to church. Yeah, They'll fight you before they got dressed. And they had to fight you while they got the dress on. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen, I've seen, uh, we were talking, me and Pastor Diaz was, was talking today. And we was reminiscing a certain a few things, places we've been. Because we've been to a lot of places. Been to a lot of places preaching the gospel. The majority of the places we've been to have been rejected. Well, anyway, he brought to my attention. Do you remember we was in in, a new, in Mexico, New Mexico, and we was up there with the L up there, and we're trying to bring them up into the knowledge of Yeshua, the truth that y'all we have blessed to be part of. Uh, and we kind of kind of laughed. I said, I remember. <laughs> you say you remember the, the the bishop there, trying to get the brother baptized, mm -hmm. <laughs> trying to motivate the brother to go on down in the water. You know, we even sang the song, "There ain't no harm in the water." <laughs> Brother scared of the water, don't want to go in the water. Preacher doing his best. You know, you need to get, be baptized for your sins can be all washed away. And mm -hmm. He didn't want to get in the water. I said, yeah, I remember. You remember what happened? I said, I sure do. 
When the brother wouldn't go, he, when he wouldn't go in the water, the preacher started cussing him out. <laughs> started, started cussing him out. Because he wasn't going to, got mad. Preacher, the preacher talks himself mad. <laughs> I'm saying, I don't understand why you're scared. It's just, it's just a little, it's not a lot of water. Why are you so? <laughs> Brother scared of them. <laughs> he, he was scared to go in the water. <laughs> so he got the cuss and stuff. <laughs> got wrong trying to do somebody right. <laughs> Cussing in the water. <laughs> so he started cussing. Hey man, they, they, the, 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 the brothers, the, the ministers looked at me, and I looked and I said, Ella, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let, hold on now. Let, let, let me handle this. I, I, let, let, let me take care of this. Because, you know, he, he surely ain't going to get him in the water cutting the mouth. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> and so after we find out that he was afraid of water, mm -hmm. so we said, well, that we'll, we'll go in with you, yeah. with him. Right. And we were baptized. So Pastor Chiller said, well, I, go, I was going to get ready to go in the water. He said, Pastor, 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 no, let mm -hmm. me go in the water. Amen. I'll go in the water with him. Yes, sir. Since, you know, since you, you, know, you did your part, mm -hmm. he ready to go in the water. So let me go in the water <laughs> with him and, and, uh, so that he, you know, he'll have enough faith mm -hmm. and feel secure that if he fall down, somebody you know, pick him back up. Mm -hmm. He didn't trust the preacher that cussed him out. <laughs> <laughs> He may drown him. He's mad. He may, he may keep him down there too long. You know, when you're mad, you take him down there and keep him down there a little longer and teach him a lesson or two. <laughs> and watch <laughs> He didn't trust him. <laughs> but anyway, we, he, amen, we was able to get him in the water without cussing him out. Mm -hmm. Amen. And when he got out there, he came up out of water. He said, this is not bad. It's not bad at all. And Pastor Chisholm kind of looked at him. It's bad about the Chisholm. And Pastor Chisholm had to stay in the spirit make sure he didn't cuss him out. So the splash, this ain't bad at all. They didn't want to come out of the water. We had the water. He said, they, all, it, the, those that baptized and came out of the water, he said, this ain't bad. So we did our part. I left. <laughs> left me in the water playing. <laughs> we did our part. They were possible. Just left me in the water playing. <laughs> Watch the word read it. That your faith, that your faith should not stand listen, in the not, wisdom that's of men. That's why we teach the way we do. So that your faith don't stand because man out there teach it. Mm -hmm. yes. That man will tell you that God don't want you to be with someone that don't love you. That's right. That's man teaching. Oh, yeah. That's man's wisdom. Yes, sir. That's man teaching. Mm -hmm. Why would God want you to be with someone that don't, you don't love him, he don't love you? That's right. That's, all the, that's what all the judges say on TV. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. Mm -hmm. Amen. That's not right. No. Mm -mm. So when they ask me, well, why would God want you to do that? I tell them the same reason why God wants you to love your enemy. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And if anybody smack you on your right cheek, offer him the other also. Oh, yes, sir. And if anyone curse you, you bless him. That's right. And if your enemy hungry, feed him. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Sir. That's why God wants you to love your wife. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. That's why the Lord will, want, will have you to forgive her. Mm -hmm. That's right. Because you know more, too. You want. Mm -hmm. You might not claim to be one. But you won. But you won. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is the testimony of the Lord. Mm -hmm. When Yeshua took them Pharisees back to what God did at the beginning. That's to right. have you not read. Mm -hmm. They've been reading. Oh, yes, sir. To that scripture for anything that you want to do. Oh, yeah. yeah. If you want to justify yourself in sin, that scripture. Mm -hmm. That scripture for you to, to take somebody else's eye out if they take yours. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Now, what's going to now, 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 I'm telling you what's going to happen to those who believe an eye for an eye and a two for a two. Mm -hmm. It's in there. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's in there. It's in there. Yes, sir. And you can follow Moses if you want to. Mm -hmm. And you can listen to them that claim they're going to follow Moses, and they don't do it neither. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, she was told them Pharisees that none of y'all keep the law. Mm -mm. None of them do. Oh, no. Mm -mm. So, yes, she was that better covenant. 
Yes, sir. He yes, come Lord. to show us the way that the true salvation. Amen. Give unto us what is right, what is the right. true will of God, how God really wants us to be. Yes, sir. Yes. So that's why he said from the beginning, mm -hmm. he, have, he who have made them both male and female, female. said for this cause shall a man leave father and mother shall and shall cleave to, to his wife. Now you mm -hmm. listen to these preachers this day, they tell you don't have to cleave. Mm -hmm. Right, yeah, yeah. And some of these preachers are kin to us. They in the family. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, sir. They're real close to us. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, it doesn't benefit you to be that close to anybody. Oh, no, it does. That's gonna cause you to go contrary. Amen. To his testimony. Yes, sir. It's not worth it. Mm -mm. Amen. Mother, amen, she's, she's not close enough. She right. shouldn't be that close. Not that close. That she can convince you that mm -hmm. you don't have to you don't have to receive the Lord's testimony mm -hmm. about your life, how you ought to live. Amen. Mother shouldn't be that close. That's right. That's right. Nobody mother should be that close. Not that close. Nobody father should be that close. Amen. I don't care if you're twins. Mm -hmm. Look just like each other. Yeah. Identical. Mm -hmm. But you, you better have a different spirit. Oh, yeah. You're yes. going to need a different spirit. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes, sir. You may, amen. You need a different spirit. Mm -hmm. And if you take on that, the Lord's spirit, I don't care if you came out the same womb mm -hmm. and you're identical twins. Right. Mm -hmm. Amen. If one got the spirit of Yahweh, the other has the spirit of Satan. Although yeah. they're identical, they won't walk identical no more. That's right. Amen. I think this thing is so it's it's so pure from heaven. It just it's so so pure. It, it'll separate twins. Oh yes, it will. It'll uh -huh. separate separate triplets. Oh yeah, yes it will. Mm -hmm. That's as I did. Yes, sir. That's the truth of it. Mm -hmm. Watch the word here. Read it. That your faith should not. That stand. your faith. Should not stand. In the wisdom of men. That's why when you hear us preaching, that's why messages don't change. Mm -hmm. Because we determine that your faith don't stand in the wisdom of men. Amen. There's a lot of men up there talking in love. Yes, sir. And if you listen to them, you're going to remain in your sin. Mm -hmm. right. If they're not saying what we're saying, that's right. then you'll never change. Yes, sir. All you have is a form of godliness. Mm -hmm. But if you, if, you, if you receive our word, mm -hmm. it'll bring you out of sin. Amen. And when it bring you out of, out of sin, be ready to be persecuted. Oh, yes. Or folk going to say, you ought to be ashamed yourself. Let that man come down here and separate you from your, from your husband or from your wife, uh -huh. from your family and all that. They been, they, they, they'll do that. Yes, sir. That's what they'll say. They will do that. Mm -hmm. They try to play on your sympathy. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. And it's not me. No. It's the words. That's right. It's, words. it's not the prophet. It's mm -hmm. the word. No. It's no. not the value. It's the words that no, we speak. it's the words. It's not mm -hmm. the pastor, it's the words that we speak. No, it's the words. Don't credit the teacher for some truth. No, no. If Yeshua the, told Peter, Peter spoke the truth, and Yeshua said, flesh and blood did not reveal this to you, you. but your father, but my father, which is from heaven, he gave it to you, Peter. That's flesh and blood didn't give that to you. That's right. If flesh and blood gave it to you, we talking like all other men. Oh, yeah. Yeshua has a question, who uh -huh. do men say that I am? Yes. And, he, and he asked, who do what, who do, what do flesh say, say that I am? Uh -huh. And yes, he said, sons of you, John the Baptist, uh -huh. Isaiah, one of the prophets, Elias, one of the prophets. Mm -hmm. But that, none of that wasn't right. Sound good. Oh yeah, that's yeah. better than you, Lucifer. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. The Pharisee was calling him Lucifer. Oh yes. And some, does he have some people trying to do good? Mm -hmm. That this man can't be Lucifer. He got to be John the Baptist. Right. Yeah. Elijah, yeah. one of these prophets, mm -hmm. and they were wrong. Yes. And Yahshua turned and said, "No, who, but who do you say that I am?" Uh huh. Peter said, "You are the Messiah, mm -hmm. the Son of God." God. Mm -hmm. And Yahshua turned and said, "Blessed are you, Simon." Flesh and blood didn't reveal, reveal this, this to you, to you but your father, which is in heaven. Yes, we never created nobody for the truth. That's right. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Truth come only from God himself. Yes, sir. Mm. So, so, so when you receive the truth, and don't listen to what people say about it. They try to give us that glory. We don't, I don't deserve it. Amen. Mm -hmm. yes, I'm only, I'm only, I'm only presenting, just like Paul. I'm only presenting unto you his testimony. Yes. What he taught. Yes, Lord. Watch this here. That your faith should not stand that in the wisdom of men. That your faith should not stand where? In the wisdom in of the men. In the wisdom of God. Men got wisdom, but it's damnable. Yes, sir. If you listen, they may, oh, yeah, that makes sense to you. Mm -hmm. Man wisdom makes sense to man. Oh, yeah. Yes. That's why you got to be in the spirit. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir, that your faith should not stand in the wisdom of man. But in the power but of Yahweh. The, you know why I call it power? Because the power of God, if you receive it, is going to bring you out of sin. Mm -hmm. It's not going to leave you in adultery. That's right. It'll leave you out of it. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. you 
from sin. Is, what the, that, that, is that what the Lord told the prophet? Mm -hmm. So I have not sent these prophets. Mm -hmm. Yet, Yet there's a lot of prophets out there God haven't sent. Mm -hmm. They got a door open. Church open, they got a pulpit where you stand behind the pulpit. Oh, yes. They got members that comes in. They yes, got the music going. Uh -huh. And the mess that he's teaching up there. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, sir. It's not accurate. It's not it's not it's not according to truth according to truth. No. But God said, because if they have stood in my counsel, mm -hmm. if I was the one that truly taught them, yes, sir. and they heard my teaching, my mm -hmm. testimony, yes, Lord. he said, then they, they would have turned you from the eve of your ways and from the eve of your doing. Doings. Yeah, she would say it's adultery. Uh -huh. Whosoever yeah. shall put away his wife, except for the cause, the cause of fornication, commits adultery. Yes, sir. And whosoever marry her, that is put away, commits awesome. adultery. Yes, well, Lord. that's the teach that came from out of hell. Yes, it did. And when you hear it, you're going to come out of it. Amen. Yes, Lord. Watch the word, read it. How be it? Yes, sir. We speak wisdom. How be them. it? Mm -hmm. How be it? Yes, sir. We speak wisdom among them that are perfect. It's not the world wisdom, mm -mm. it's the wisdom that comes from above. Yes, sir. And he's saying we speak wisdom among them that are what, what, what? Perfect. You got to have a perfect heart to receive this wisdom from above. Yes, sir. Amen. reason why some men can't get it because their heart is not perfect. That's right. They don't have a, a heart. You know, they got different shapes out there, you know. Mm -hmm. They make toys for kids. Yes, sir. Yeah. They make some toys and they got shapes, mm -hmm. round shapes, yeah. squares, triangles, yeah. Oh, yeah. rectangles, mm -hmm. shape. Mm -hmm. And they put it down yeah. and, 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 and you take that squirrel yeah. shape. And it's not going to fit right. in that mm -hmm. rectangle. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Yeah. It doesn't fit. Mm -mm. You got to put it put it in the in its, in its proper place. Yes, sir. You can force none you want to. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> you can cut some edges off of yeah. and all that. Hammer but you tamped it oh, with yeah. it down. Mm -hmm. so, so you, you, hey, man, we know you tamped yeah. You shouldn't have no two squares. <laughs> right. You're supposed to have right. one. Right. And that's how it is with this truth about righteousness, the way to God. Mm -hmm. There's only one faith, the Bible says. Yes, sir. There's yes, no Lord. two, there's no two faith. There's only one, one faith. faith. For me and for you. Mm -hmm. And for the whole entire world. Yes, Lord. One thing to believe in. Oh, yes, sir. You can't yes, fix it up the no, way you want it. Can't shape it. Mm -hmm. Yes, she was said, all that have come to me, they're all every man. Mm -hmm. Everyone that come to me. They're number thieves. They're number mm -hmm. robbers. Yes, sir. So he said, therefore, you're going to clean yourself up. You got to come in at the door. Amen. You can't have some. You, amen. If, 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 if it's, a, it's a Sylvia, Sister Silas, these mm -hmm. sisters, yes. if they can't have another man. That's right. Mm -hmm. While their husband is living, mm -hmm. no other woman can have That's it. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Why is God going to tell them they yeah. can't have it right. and be saved and tell you you can't? Uh-huh. Yeah. Why is the Lord going to tell me I have to turn the other sheep cheap? But you can slap when someone hits you. <laughs> because that preacher out there is to tell you you have a yeah. right to defend That's yourself. Right. Yeah. Uh -huh. And the court will uphold that. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. They got courts that will uphold uh -huh. the, uh, uh, defending yourself. Yes. Oh, yeah. Self-defense. Right, yeah. They made a law where you can defend yourself. Yes. And you won't have to go to jail and spend no time. Right, right. But you got to meet another judge, oh, though, yeah. see. Those that do such things will have to meet oh, the yeah. judge of all. all. Yeah, judge of all. There is a judge that is a judge all. over all. Oh, yeah. And they going to have to give an account oh, why yeah. they did what they did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, stand your ground law. <laughs> but Yeshua, that's not his testimony. No, it's not. He said when they persecute you in one city, they flee. Flee to the next. He didn't say stand your ground. <laughs> no. No. He said, flee. Yes. Yes, and he rebuked Peter for standing his ground. Yeah. Peter took yeah, out his sword. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he cut off, cut off the man's ear. Uh -huh. And yeah. Yeshua looked at him and said, Peter, that's right, stand your ground. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I haven't read that. Yeah, haven't that's read not his testimony. That's why we can't find. read it that's because right. that's not his testimony. Yes. But instead, he looked at Peter and said, Peter, put your sword up. Uh -huh. He lived by the sword, die by the sword. They that live by the sword so would die by, die by it. You will perish by it. Mm -hmm. Don't you know I have the power to call angels from out of heaven mm -hmm. if I yes. need defending? Mm -hmm. Yes. But for this cause, I came into Do this it. world. Mm -hmm. yeah. So there's no law. You can't. Right. We run. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Because that's what his testimony. Yes. Yeshua's testimony says mm -hmm. if they if they persecute, persecute you in one, one city, city. Mm -hmm. 
It may cost you a lot of money to move out of one city to go. You may, but that's not what it takes right. to obtain eternal life. Oh, yes. is what you got do to it. do. Yes, sir. It's law. So the law said you flee into another city. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. That's what he said. Yes, Lord. He said, for the time will come that whosoever killeth you would think they're doing my father's will. And a lot of preachers standing in the pulpit lying to you really thinking they're doing God's will. Oh, yes, sir. Because they're looking at, they, they, you got preachers that, 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 that they lean on emotion. Oh, yeah, yes. yes. They see the Feelings. pain in your eye. Uh-huh, yes. Mm -hmm. And they forget all about what the word taught. Right. The Lord yeah. said, if any should come after me, let him first deny, deny himself. himself. Let him first deny. If you're going to follow me, the Lord yeah. said, you have to deny yourself. Mm -hmm. And then he said, let, and then you must take up your cross. Mm -hmm. And follow me. Yes. Because he that seeks to save his life. So a lot of women hear what right. and a lot a lot of women women and men they hear what we teach about divorce and remarriage. Mm -hmm. And they want to save it. That's right. Yeah, save so it. So they want to save it. Mm -hmm. they, they try to find a way why it's right to, you know, for me to have Sam. Mm -hmm. you no, know, Frank don't want him. Right. Frank, you know, he 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 you know, he's no good. Mm -hmm. He's an alcoholic. Right. You know, he, he don't work. He'd no. sleep on the street. Mm -hmm. And this man take care of me and, and Sammy and, uh, and, yeah. and Julie and, and James and Kevin and, mm -hmm. and, and Rebecca mm -hmm. and Tim Tim. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at all we, we, what we got. Don't have to worry about food, right. Dean. Mm -hmm. He provides. God, God gave him to me. Uh -huh. No, God ain't going to no, do nothing no, like that. No, he's not. God is not going to go contrary to his word. No, he's not. He's not gonna go contrary to the, you remember you remember Yeshua? He was in, in the garden of Gethsemane. You remember mm -hmm. that there praying? Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Saying, Father, if it be yeah, thy will. Yeah. His will. God didn't change his will for his for his son. He surely ain't gonna change it for us. That's right. Amen. And so we have to do just like the master. He's mm -hmm. we have to humble ourselves. He says, yes, Nevertheless, not my will, yeah. because Yeshua sure knew that the done. Father's will yeah. was for him to come and uh -huh. to die. Oh, yeah. yes, he so knew. he wasn't gonna change it because no. he was in the garden of Gethsemane crying. Mm -mm. He didn't change his will. He saw his son. Uh -huh. He saw his son. But the thing, diff the difference between Yeshua having that flesh on and Yahweh being spirit is the difference. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. He don't have flesh on. Right. Right. Yahweh y'all don't have no flesh on. Right. That's why he can snap his finger and, and, and wipe out a billion people. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it won't even bother him. <laughs> right. But it bothers you. You spend your time. What why God let that happen? Uh -huh. But he's not like you. <laughs> that's right. Amen. He's not like us. Oh, yeah. That's right. He's as the heavens are far above the earth. Come so are my ways, ways above, above your ways. ways and my thinking. Oh, yeah. Right. Then mm. the way you think. Oh, yes. Far higher. Far higher. Because mm. he's God. Yes. He don't think like us. Mm -mm. And that's why we have to take on his mind. Yes, Lord. Watch the word read it. How be it we speak How wisdom. How be it we speak wisdom among them that are well, perfect. Well, we teach. Amen. You got to be perfect to receive it. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you got to have the right heart. Yes. To receive what we have to say, mm -hmm. because what we have to say is not favorable. That's right. With mankind. Amen. Not even with us. We won't accept it because we want to be saved. That's right. That's right. If I can find strip, I can fight you back, I do it. <laughs> and be right. <laughs> but we know it don't exist, yeah, so yeah, we humble ourselves yeah. like the Lord and nevertheless, not my will. will but let done. your will be done. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. <laughs> Watch the word. Yet not the wisdom of this world. Yet not listen to what he said that. Love it. You hear me? San Antonio. The wisdom we're talking about is not of this world. It's not, no it's not found in love. Mm -mm. It's not found in San Antonio. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It's not of this world. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Run to Africa. It's not found out there. They, 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 they have to throw a spirit you out there. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, are you mad? Are oh, you listening to me? Yes, Lord. Go to Russia. They, they'll shoot you over there. Mm -hmm. yeah. So oh, yeah. this wisdom where we where we teach not is not wisdom. of this, this world. world. Mm -mm. Yes, sir. It's not of this world. No Lord. Come on. Nor of the princes and of nor, this world. And the princes, and I give you in the spirit allow you to, you know, to name them. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Who are the princes? You know, princes are people that you look up to. Mm -hmm. You consider to be of God. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. He got to be of God. Look how right. big his church is. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. God, he got to be God because that's yeah. my daddy. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, she got to be of God. That's grandma. Grandma mm -hmm. always pray. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, he yeah. hit you with that cane too. <laughs> See a cane? You. <laughs> the prince is in the body that you you look to. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You esteem to yeah, be of God to receive that counsel. Mm -hmm. So so what do, do so so how do people? I mean, how do they describe us? How do they talk about it? Talk about us? What they say? They say, "Who is he? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who is he?" Yeah. That's what they say about it. who is he? Mm -hmm. yeah. Because it's not many of us. Right, right, right. Yeah. Who are they? Mm -hmm. Who are they? Mm -hmm. Look what they did. Mm -hmm. They what they did the apostles. Uh -huh. They came here also. Them that turned the world upside down. Uh -huh. <laughs> the apostles they were turning everything upside down. <laughs> Everywhere they went, yes. they went to Ephesus. They turned Ephesus <laughs> upside down. Upside they down. went to uh, Philippi. Mm -hmm. Philippi. They mm -hmm. turned Philippi upside, upside down. down. They went to Galatia. Turned that upside down. Upside down. Went to Rome. Turned that upside down. Yes. Everywhere we go, we turn everything upside down. Oh yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, sir. You can tell when a tornado been through the city. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff is upside down. Yeah. Things so, are destroyed. Yes. Devastated. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And so people get offended and we go places. Here they come. Mm -hmm. You know why I say they? Because the message mm -hmm. that we have is not of this world. All right. Oh, yeah. How did everybody love and get along? Mm -hmm. San right. Antonio get along. Mm hmm. And they don't even bleed the same. <laughs> mm -hmm. But we the most wicked people no, he, because we tell the truth. That's right. Amen. And the mm -hmm. truth convicts folk, no condemns. Mm -hmm. I remember one day on the job, I was, we was talking about the same topic, and there was another man listening, and he got mad. Mm -hmm. To know you didn't call my uncle a false prophet, and I wasn't even talking to him. He was just listening. <laughs> No, you didn't call my uncle a false prophet. And I looked, realized he was talking to me. So I didn't call your uncle no false. I don't know your uncle. Got offended because he knew his uncle. <laughs> he, well, his uncle the one of the preachers say, you know, if y'all if you don't love one another, God, there's no need for y'all to be together. God don't want you to be together if y'all don't love each other. Mm -hmm. Or he don't he's not treating you right. God don't want y'all to be together. Right. His mm -hmm. uncle is one of them. I didn't say his name. Oh no, no. Mm -hmm. Shoe fit? I mean, you wear eight, and the shoe is eight. That's your shoe. That's your shoe. Everybody else wear 10, and you don't want to have with an eight, and you missing a shoe, too? That's your shoe. And it's like the one you got on your other, side, other, other feet. That got to be your shoe. Oh, yeah. well, that's not my shoe. Where your other shoe at? It look like the one you got on your left feet. Where your right shoe at? Uh -huh. Right in the mud where you left it at, right there. <laughs> Why is the word reading? Yet yeah, not the wisdom of this not world. Not the wisdom of this world. Nor of the princes. No, the princes. And that's that's there's no need to try to compare us with the princes. Mm -mm. Billy Graham. No. T D J. No. Earl Roberts. Mm -mm. Jimmy Swagger. Mm -mm. All these don't don't oh, yeah. don't compare us with all those no, men. Not those it's the worst thing you can do oh, with yes. the ministers here. That's right. Is compare yeah. us with the princes uh -huh. of this world. Yes, sir. Come on, read it. Nor the princes of this world uh -huh. that come to naught. That knock. come what, what, what? Come to naught. It don't make no difference what they teach. It's going to come to naught. Yes, mm -hmm. It don't make no difference what they say. It's going to come to naught. Mm -hmm. That comes to naught. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But we speak the but wisdom of Yahweh. This is what we do here. Mm -hmm. In a mystery. This is what we do here. Mm -hmm. We speak. Yes, sir. We speak. 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 That's why Sister Sylvia, she packed her bag and moved out here mm -hmm. because we there speak. wasn't no we up there speaking like us. Mm -hmm. Amen. There wasn't no we in Lubbock that mm -hmm. was that was speaking like us. Mm -hmm. And she knew that. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. All of us be here today because of what we speak we here. Speak. Mm -hmm. and we wouldn't be what we are. Mm -hmm. they're, they're not Yahweh because we speak. We speak God's wisdom, mm -hmm. you know, it was spoken here, we heard it, and they did not help us. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yes, it did. Yes, they did not clean us up. Yeah, yes, it did. And we still working on ourselves. Oh, yeah. still. still growing higher, higher. Yes. 
Hallelujah. Because of what is spoken here. Yes, because we speak. Paul said we speak the wisdom of God. In a mystery. In a what? In a mystery. It's a mystery is something that everybody can't get. That's right. They can't see. They can't look into. Mm -hmm. I remember when that cubit cube came out. Rubik, oh, whatever they oh, call it. What is it called? Rubik's Cube. Rubik's Cube. Mm -hmm. It looked like he can do it. Oh, it was a mystery oh, yes. how to work that thing. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You say what, bro? Oh, yeah. you, you just couldn't get it. Oh, no. You know what I did when I first got it? I, I take that tape off. I take the color off. Yeah, I was determined to be wise. <laughs> I was determined that folks said, wow, he can do it. So I, I peeled it off. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And replaced it. all the colors on the same side. Because mm -hmm. I was determined I was going to let no kid outdo me. <laughs> mm -hmm. When you think can't get it, there it is. You get one side, you get happy, look at the other side, the other side messed up. <laughs> said, this is a mystery. This thing is a mystery. It Love is. it. San Antonio mm -hmm. world, this thing is a mystery. It's a mystery. Mm -hmm. It's a mystery. Yes, sir. will be hid. Yeah. It is hid to them that are lost, in whom the God of this world have blinded their mind. To them that believe not. To them who don't believe. Yes, sir. The reason why they down because they won't believe. Mm -hmm. When they right. hear the report, they won't believe it. Yes, Lord. Just don't make no sense. Mm -hmm. Yes. Why well, you have to wait on somebody who don't want you? It don't make no sense. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Listen to me. Yes, Lord. Are oh, y'all listening to me? Yes, sir. It's not right mm -mm. to do that. Mm -mm. No. Because this is his testimony. Yes, it is. Nothing else should shine in your heart no. but his word. None but this. Amen. His word. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. And you can find, I promise you, you will find life. Yes. You'll find the strength you need to perform the works of God and be ready to be persecuted. Amen. Be yes, ready sir. to be scorned. Mm -hmm. Be ready to be criticized. Mm -hmm. Be ready to be called stupid. Oh, yeah. All these things that come upon all the righteous That's who right. believe the report. Yes, Lord. You will suffer for righteousness. Yes, you will. Because yes, the world Lord. don't expect folks in your family to understand why you did what you did. That's right. Amen. They won't understand it because yes, it Lord. don't make no sense to them. That's right. The salvation that comes from God do not make sense to the world. Mm -mm. No. Watch the word. Read it. Even the hidden wisdom. Even the hidden wisdom. Which Yahweh which ordained. Yahweh. Oh, Melissa, that, that, this ought to make you shout. This hidden wisdom, Yahweh had, and he hasn't ordained this for everybody. No, amen. This has been ordained for special people. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You hear me talking, love it? If you can see this, it, it's, it's been ordained to you. Yes, Not sir. everybody in love. Mm -mm. There right. was many down at the, at the pool sick, but yes, you want to heal one. That's right. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. There were many widows in, in the land of uh, 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 Israel at the time of Elijah, but God sent Elijah only to one, one widow. One, one of them. So if you, you may be just one person loved being saved. Mm -hmm. If Amen. that be the case, so be it. Yes, that's sir. one in San Antonio. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yes, sir. Mother Mary grabbed hold to this yes, thing. She did. Yeah. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you listening to me? Yes, Lord. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Watch the word, read it. Which Yahweh ordained. Which Yahweh has ordained. Before the world before unto our glory. Before the world unto our glory. Yes, sir. Before God created the world, he knew what was going to take place. Mm -hmm. And he said, you know, I got salvation for you. Amen. This has been ordained, ordained from the ordained beginning. For you. Yes, sir. There's nothing that he don't know. Amen. That's going to happen that he don't. He, he, that he's not aware of it. And even Yahweh Himself give us. We get a chance to taste Him because the Scripture said we all are gods. Mm -hmm. Amen. So Amen. even a father and a mother with their child and know what, what he's going to do. Mm -hmm. Amen. He think Daddy and Mama don't know. Right. Yes. But Daddy and Mama know what he's going to do. Mm -hmm. He got the he got the, he got the keys uh -huh. and he over there by the, 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 right. the plug. Uh -huh. Got the keys. He act like you know him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kind of look down at it. Uh -huh. That I'm, I'm already know already what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Amen. I already know. Look back down at it and stuff. Mm -hmm. So we know when, when you, once you reach a certain age, you know the action of children. You, oh, you yes, learn sir. your child. Oh, yes, you know sir. what he's going to do before he do it. Uh -huh. You say, boy, you better not put them keys. <laughs> put them keys up. Uh-huh. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> That's how daddy mama know about you, Jojo. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. He got that smile on his face like, wow, that's how they do it. <laughs> he got that look on his face like, wow, that's how they do it. <laughs> I thought she did it because she was a prophetess and he was an apostle. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> Rachel, don't you know your kids? <laughs> now, teach you know your daughter? Of course you know her. Mm -hmm. She's cute and everything. Keep out on she, she'll kill herself. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Watch the word. Come on, read. Which Yahweh ordained yes, sir. before the world before unto our glory. The world, before, uh, before the world unto our glory. To our glory. It's for us to receive. It's for us to walk in it. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. God called us to walk in it. Mm -hmm. So that's why the Lord said, let your light so shine mm -hmm. that man may see your good works yes, and glorify your Father which, which is in heaven. heaven. He said, you are my witnesses whom I have chosen. Mm -hmm. see, you, if you can see this, you've been chosen of oh, Yahweh. Yeah, yeah, Yahweh so. said, you my witness. Mm -hmm. yes, Watch the word, read it. Which none of the princes of this Which world none, do. So that, does that answer why Bishop mm -hmm. Jake don't know this? Yes. Yeah, so. mm -hmm. Does it make sense now why Earl Roberts don't know this? That's why right. he, he don't teach it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, old dollar. <laughs> Jim and Swag, you don't understand why? Now you know why? Why, why it's not preached over there? That's because right. they, the scripture said they don't know. It's not That's given to them to right. know. Yes, Yeshua says it's given unto you to know. Uh huh. Yes, sir. It's not given to them to know. They don't have the, a heart to know. Yes, Lord. They don't want to know. They don't want to change their way. That's right. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So if you're in love with, in San Antonio, you listen to it because some men say, you know, I need to hear what they got to say there. Mm -hmm. So about a proper told you today. I know you ain't you're gonna be listening to them tonight. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, yeah. You know. Some of you say, yes, I'm, I'm gonna have to tune in. Mm -hmm. I don't understand all that, but yeah, some about what they teach. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Amen. And that's why your ears are blessed. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, sir. And you are always making a way for you so you can receive it. Yes, he is. And more you hear it, more you just you're gonna be strengthened. Mm -hmm. And more your understanding is going to come open. Amen. That's why, that's why, that's why you can't, yeah, that's why many that in, in, you in love, that's why many you can't root up to the civil. She, she, she got it in her. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's in her. Mm -hmm. She's addicted. Oh, yeah, sir. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. folks addicted to cocaine. Mm -hmm. oh, this yeah. thing get in, you become addicted. Yeah, got to have it. Got to I got to have it. Mm -hmm. We go crazy. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. We start itching and stuff. <laughs> I got to get on to the church because uh, <laughs> I'm about to fight you. I better get on back to the church. <laughs> That's right. I'm about, I'm about to cuss you out. I think I'm going to make the two. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, yeah. And it's in you. Got, you, got, you just got to be part of it. That's right. You want to be part of it. Yes, sir. Much as we don't like it, but it's in us. We, yes. We're addicted to it. Need it. Yes, Come on, read. Which none of the princes of this world knew. Which none knew. of the princes of the world knew. For had they because known if it, they had known, they would not, have, they crucified would not have crucified the Lord, the Lord of, glory. of glory. But as, but it, as is written, it is written, I have not seen, eyes have not seen, nor ear heard, ears they have not heard, neither have entered into the heart even of man, into their heart, 
the things which God Yahweh and listen prepared. to what it said. It hasn't even entered into their hearts. Yes, sir. The thing which God had prepared, prepared unto who? For them that love him. Oh, my Lord. It's not for everybody. Mm -mm. Daddy might not love the Lord That's like right. you think, like mm -hmm. he say he do. Uh -huh. Mama may not love the Lord yes, like she say she do. Yes, sir. The bishop might not love the Lord like mm -hmm. he's claimed that he do. That's right. Mother Mary said amen. Mm -hmm. See, she in San Antonio, she said amen. <laughs> and the Bible said all the people said yeah, amen. Yeah, all of them said amen. And you can't say amen to what the word is saying. Right. Something wrong with That's you. That's right, yeah. Something wrong with you. You can't say yeah. amen. Not the word. Why I'm going to get offended when I say daddy might not get this thing? Mm -hmm. right. And why would I take that person? you talking about my daddy. Uh -huh. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, why would I be offended at that? No. Mm -mm. Yes, sir. Prepare for them that love him. This thing is only prepared for them that love him. Mm -hmm. So it's if you're here today because you love the Lord. Mm -hmm. And the Lord prepared it for you. Mm -hmm. That's why you're here. Yes, sir. That's, That's why. why you can't be rooted up. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yes, you would talk about, hey, amen. You know, he, he spoke parables quite often. Oh, yes, he did. And he talked about one parable about a certain man who built his house upon the sand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then he talked about another man who built his house upon a rock. Mm -hmm. They both built. Yes, but sir. one was a fool. Mm -hmm. The other one was wise because yes, Satan is real. He's mm -hmm. going to beat upon you. Oh, yes, sir. And if you're not built upon and been established on a rock, that yes, rock sir. is the Messiah. Yes, sir. That, that rock been with you all this time. Mm -hmm. Even when you didn't know him, that rock kept you safe, oh, kept yes. death back mm -hmm. for this day and yes, for sir. this hour. Yes, sir. So you can be saved and be delivered. Yes, Lord. Because Satan, he come and does he come, sister? He come mm -hmm. and he beat. Yes, he does. If you're on that rock, mm -hmm. hey, man, you're not going away. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You're not going away. No. Because mm -hmm. you know ain't nothing out there for you. That's right. You became what you are today because of the, of the, of the message, mm -hmm. the report, his testimony. Yes, sir. It's got you here today. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yes, Lord. Watch the word. Read it. Which Yahweh hath prepared for them that uh -huh. love him. Yes, sir. But Yahweh hath revealed them unto us oh, by his oh spirit. Oh, my Lord. I love, listen to it. No, I did plenty of research. Hath revealed them unto us by his spirit. No, I read some man commentary. He had revealed them unto us by his spirit. No, see, these, these, these days, internet helps a great deal. But Yahweh hath revealed them Lord. unto us by his spirit. No, you got to know the, 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 the venture code. He hath revealed them unto us by his spirit. This is how you're going to get it. It's, mm -hmm. it's by the Spirit. Yes, sir. It's by the Spirit. Yes, Lord. It's, that's why when you come to, and, and, and the Spirit just get it just it, one word, one message go out, mm -hmm. and it deals with all of all us. All of us. Yes, sir. It works with all of us. Mm -hmm. Show us where we're wrong. Show us where we need to better ourselves. Show yes, us where we need to increase our faith. Oh, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. It's the Spirit that does that. Yes, sir. Listen, listen, no, our folk get mad at us. Mm -hmm. The Bible said, the word said, it searches all, all things. things. It searches all things. All things. It know why you dress the way you dress. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. So when you get, get around the spirit, it's going to let you know uh -huh. why you purchased that dress. That's right. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. It let you know why you're lifting weights. That's right. Yes, Lord. It searches all things. It searches all things. Yes, Lord. It knows your reason. Oh, yes. Sir. You may cover it up with, thus said the Lord. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes, you would say, God, God told the prophet, said they swear in vain. Oh, yes. Sir. When they say, surely the Lord live it. They don't, they, cause right. people talk don't mean nothing. They don't That's mean right. all that. Oh, yeah. That's true. So he told the man, man, God said, you can't believe all that what folks say. That's right. Amen. Doing this for the ministry. Yeah, right. <laughs> Amen. You hear this talking? The Bible says the Spirit searches all, all things. things. You're in it you're right now. You're in love. In, in Mother Mary in San Antonio. But you're listening, though, huh? Mm -hmm. And the Spirit is searching. searching. Mm -hmm. Why searching? Here is searching in love. Yeah, yes. And it's searching in San oh, Antonio yes. and anybody else that is That's listening. Right. Mother Kathy and Mother, she be listening. Oh, yeah. searching over there, too. Yes, yeah, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Son is New York. It's searching in New York. That's right. Mm hmm Yeah. Search it all things. It searches all things. Mm hmm We sing a song, come out that corner. You can't hide. <laughs> the church light on. <laughs> oh yeah. Cut the lights off right quick. Cut the lights off. Cut the other light off.
That one don't go off. But if that went off, I can give you the finger. You wouldn't even know it. <laughs> That's not a lot of light, but y'all can see me up here. <laughs> and then that corner back there, right, yeah. I, uh, uh, I can see Deacon back there. All I see darkness. Oh, yeah, oh, he can yeah. stick his tongue out. I wouldn't even know yeah, it. I wouldn't even see it. He'd be oh. telling me smiling, but he got a tongue out. Oh, yeah. All right, cut the light back off. <laughs> See, now you got to line up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. See, now you got to line up. The light's on now. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. The light's on. Yeah. We can see you when you fall asleep. <laughs> when the light's on, you can't <laughs> you can lay on the floor. Nobody wouldn't know you're there. <laughs> so in Yahweh's house, the light is on. Yes, it is. Always on. Yes, sir. The spirit goes out and it searches all things. Searches all things. Huh? Do I got a witness here tonight? Oh, yeah. Don't it search it? Yeah. yeah. Yes, sir. And because you know the spirit, that the spirit searches all things, mm -hmm. it helps you to walk the way you ought to walk. Because mm -hmm. you know you got to make it back to the church. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord. So it helps you. The spirit helps us. Yes, sir. But it searches all, all things. things. And watch this here. Yea, the deep Yay, things of Yahweh. Yeah, the what kind of thing? The deep things the of Yahweh. The deep things of Yahweh. Mm -hmm. It even searches the deep, the deep things, things of Yahweh. Of Yahweh. And those are the things that the world cannot receive. Amen. This causes too much for them. Yes, sir. Yea, the deep things of God. Yes, sir. Come on. For what man knoweth for the what things man of a man? Know it, that's why a lot of folks, that's why the world can understand the world. Mm -hmm. Yeshua said the world love his own. Mm -hmm. So a man, a worldly man, would understand the solace. Right. Uh huh. You know, they'll tell you, you know, you, yeah, if you yeah. your husband don't want you, you go out and find somebody that wants you. Mm -hmm. The world yeah, understand that because it makes sense to a man. Right. Oh, yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. That makes sense to a man. Mm -hmm. It makes sense to a man. It means someone don't like you, don't care about him. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, that makes sense. Oh yeah. You mm -hmm. don't like me. I see you uh, walking. I'm not gonna pick you up. Right. Right. Then I hope it rains. Uh-huh, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And if it did rain, you better not be close to the curve because I'm trash, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> the spirit of man understand the yeah. spirit of a man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's why a pastor Jenkins taught talk his balls. If someone hit you, mm -hmm. y'all double team them. Y'all twins. That's a gift I received from God. <laughs> One go high, one go low. <laughs> now come on in the backyard. I'm going to show you how to go high. Uh -huh. I'm going to call one high, one low. That's your nickname. <laughs> high low. High low. <laughs> Don't miss a high low, Jenkins. <laughs> but then, but, what, but see, but Pastor Jenkins got to come back and take that back. Yeah, son, yeah, don't yeah. go high yeah, he, and yeah. don't go low. Right. But that what we do. Run, boy, <laughs> run. Like yeah, the Lord said, yeah, flee. Flee. Amen. Amen. You had to come back and put, put, put what was right in your boys, didn't you? Uh -huh. We all had to put what was right in our kids. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, Lord. Yes, shall we. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Come on, let's finish this thing now. For what man knoweth the things of a man, save the spirit of a man save which is in him? Save the spirit him. of a man that is in him. Mm -hmm. They know one another. Yes, sir. They can relate to one another. Mm -hmm. That's why these fault churches, they so big, because they can relate to those messages. That's right. I can if I, was, if I was a natural preacher, mm -hmm. I'm looking at your spirit, seeing what you trouble with, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ease your trouble with man wisdom. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not with the wisdom, not with the wisdom and counsel of God, no. but with the counsel of men. Mm -hmm. and so when they call themselves having what uh, marital support right. in churches, uh -huh. counsel, yeah, all that, yeah. and when they get through, realize it's already in your heart, you can't stand each other. And they'll really recommend you to find somebody else in the church to be with. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Mm. And I'll just find you somebody. You know what? You and Sister uh, uh, <laughs> Sister uh, uh, Melvin. I mean, uh, Mel Melody. One <laughs> 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 high, one low. <laughs> you can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Time you find a new church. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Oh, my. 
But anyway, when you looked at me, you look like you like your dad. I saw your dad. <laughs> we were just talking about your dad today. I said, I'm <laughs> yeah, you went up there. <laughs> I ain't seen him go up that high before. <laughs> but they tell you go over you know, and Sister oh, yeah. uh, Melody. Yeah, she more, Y'all make good couples. Yeah, yeah more compatible. Mm-hmm. But that's not how it's supposed to be. Right, right. Because that's going to change the oh, word yeah. of the Lord. Yeah. It's going to change his testimony. Right. Husband, love your wife. Uh-huh, yes. No man never hated his own uh-huh. flesh. Uh-huh. But, but he nourished it, he cherished it. Cherish cherish it. it. Mm-hmm. Take care of it, even as the Messiah does the church. church. Have not the Lord taken care of us? Yes, He has. There was a time we was we was sick and we was weak. And I'm talking about spiritually, so not oh, yeah. naturally. So, yes, about spirit in the heart mm-hmm. and in the mind. Yes, Lord. The Lord didn't cut us off, oh, but no. He took care of us. The social man love his his own wife mm-hmm. the same way. Yes, sir. Pay hey, yeah, love him. Mm-hmm. Be patient with him. Yes, sir. Overcome evil with good. With good. Right, that's how you're going to do your husband. So see if you keep on doing that. Mm-hmm. Keep on overcoming the evil with good. Because the spirits that hide and know it's that old wife. You may save your husband. So you chase conversation. The solid, you may save him. Mm-hmm. Come on, let's get through. I need to finish. Even so, the things of Yahweh knoweth uh-huh. no man, yes. but the spirit of Yahweh. But the spirit, that's why the spirit knows everything about us. Mm-hmm. And yes, no sir. man don't we don't know I don't I don't know what you've been doing all day, right. but make it to the house of the Lord watch the spirit. Mm-hmm. Cut us on, listen to us on, on on the internet and watch the spirit. Mm-hmm. I haven't been to San Antonio and love it, but the spirit is always there. Yes, sir. Yes, Lord. Always there. Yes, sir. Come on, read it. Now we have received. Now not we have not received world, the spirit of this world. But the spirit that's why which we is don't of Yahweh. agree with the spirit of this world. Mm-hmm. We agree with the spirit of Yahweh. Yes, what sir. Yahweh said, that's how it is. Amen. Come on, read. That we might know the things that are that we given might to us know the things that Yahweh. we not. That's not for everybody. That, 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 so leave everybody out of it. Mm-mm. Leave everyone out of it. Yes, sir. Spirit said that we may know the things that are freely given to us of God. We don't yes, deserve sir. it. But it's the Lord saw fit. Amen. To allow us to be part of something that is great and wonderful. Yes, sir. Part of the truth. Yes, Lord. Freely mm-hmm. receive those Yahweh. things that are ordained from yes, God. Sir. Yes, Come on. Lord. Which things also we which speak. Which things also we speak. Not that's, in the words which man's wisdom That's why we teach teaches. the way we teach. Mm-hmm. And the man, the man wisdom don't teach, they don't teach about adultery like we do. No, Lord. Man wisdom don't teach about that a bishop can only have one wife. Right. No, no. Mm-hmm. He's not, not going to find it. No, not going to find it. It's, it's found in the church. Yes. Only if my church. wife die, I cannot remarry. That's right. I'm oh, a yeah. bishop. Uh-huh. I must be the husband the of one, one wife. wife. Mm-hmm. That's found in the church. Yeah, only in the church. Mm-hmm. Widows. To the effort truth to be a widow indeed, she can't. She I mean she cannot remarry again. That's right. Mm-hmm.
<laughs> oh, yeah, listen to me. Yes, That's Lord. just how it is. Oh, no, yes, sir. So any man claim himself to be a, a pastor and he had been he's the husband of two wives, he does not meet the qualifications. That's right, yeah. He's, yeah. Only one he wife. He cannot he can he cannot serve in that. That's right. This is his testimony. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. We declare Lord. unto man the testimony of the Lord, not I, not what we think about it. I wouldn't care who teach. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It don't matter to me who runs the church. Right. Mm -hmm. But to Amen. him it does matter. That's right. A husband, amen, the bishop must be the husband of one wife. That includes the apostles, prophets, evangelists, pastors, and teachers. So these are the men that are ordained to be overseers of the church. And we, can, we, can't, we cannot remarry. No, we can't. And there are men out there that have outlived their first wife, and they have taken on a second wife, and they call themselves pastor. They can't be one. Can't be one. They can't be one. That's right. And what did Paul say that again? Which things also we which speak. Which things also we speak. Not in the words which not man's in words wisdom which, teaches. Which, 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 which a man wisdom teaches. A man mm -hmm. wisdom say if God called you. But he don't call you if you marry twice. No, no, no. no. He's not going to call you to do that. That's right. Amen. Call you to sit down. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're calling yourself. Oh, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. you, yeah, those that does it, they call themselves. But yeah, God didn't yeah. do it. Right. That's why the Lord said many were saying that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied right. in your name? Mm -hmm. Have not we cast, cast our devils, devils in your name? Have not we did many marvelous work works. in your name? And the Lord said, in that day when mm. I see him, I'm going to tell him, I never knew you. Oof. I oh, never, my. I was never with mm. you. No. Mm. I never, not only, not, 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 not only was I not with you, mm -hmm. I never knew you. Mm. A lot of people are going to be surprised in that day. A lot of people are going to be surprised. A lot of church-going folks. Mm -hmm. And there's going to be a lot of fathers, mm -hmm. yeah. a lot of mothers, yes, sir. grandfathers and grandmothers and mm -hmm. brothers and sisters in that day when they meet God and realize they don't have no salvation. Amen. All they labor was in iniquity, mm -hmm. yes, which sir. means it was corrupt. Yes, it, was, it was contrary yes, sir. to what God ordained. Yes, Just sir. like it's a lot of gay folks going to be Surprising mm -hmm. that day. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. God yeah, never deeper, put right? a man with a man. No, no. never. But this cause that a man leave father and mother. mother. Sin shaped him to be that. Right. And he right. can't live that kind of life. No. Mm -mm. That's why I can't burn folks' house down no more. Right. right. Sin shaped me. I like it. Mm hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. Lord. Mm -hmm. Father, what, what you get out of burning people's house down? Same reason you get out of pinching kids. <laughs> 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 but, uh, sin shape you like that. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it give you a thrill to see them suffer. <laughs> Baby back there sound sleep and every time you come over when you go in the restroom, call yourself going to the restroom and you come back and hear the baby holler. And it only happened when you show up over to that. <laughs> they talking about a little bug. He got red right there. Like must have, some must have bit him right there. That's you. That's you. That's you. Pinch them. And you a pincher. You need to stop pinching. <laughs> if I can't burn, you can't pinch. <laughs> so sin shaped all of us. We yeah, all are messed true. up some fashion, yeah. some form. Yes, sir. And sin shaped us like that, and we can't be like that because, right. hey, man, because sin, we were born that way. That's right. You have to be converted. You got to be, be converted, born again. Born again. Yes, Not of flesh, but no, of the spirit. Sir. Yes, sir. Take on his mind. Come on, I need to get through. But which the Holy Ghost teaches. But that's what we do. Comparing spiritual things with spiritual. We spiritual, compare spiritual things with spiritual things. But the natural compare man, what the spirit wants. Yes, sir. With the spirit. Not what high emotion, right. with emotion, but with the spirit. What yes, did the sir. Lord say about this? Mm -hmm. And the Bible said, my our spirit bear witness with his spirit. His spirit. Amen. That we are his son. We can mm -hmm. bear, if you can't if you can't bear witness to the truth, then you're not his child. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. So that's why everyone can't be like my sister. Everyone will have the kind of faith that Sister Sylvia has. No. See, her spirit bear witness to his spirit. To his spirit. That, that's how the spirit wants her to live. Amen. And all men gonna try to talk her out of it. That's right. That's right. And it doesn't work that way. No. Mm -hmm. 
Come on, verse and they get through. But the natural man, the natural man receiving not the things he can't, of the spirit of God. Because he's natural minded. He cannot receive the spiritual thing. He can't receive this truth that you're hearing tonight. Mm -mm, uh -huh. he For they are foolishness unto him. Because it don't make no sense to him. Mm -hmm. The ways of God doesn't make sense to a natural minded man. Mm -mm. You hit me, I'm going to hit you back. That's the, that's, that makes right, sense. Right. So Turning of the cheek don't make no sense. Right, no. Mm -mm. They say you're a sissy. Yes. Mm -hmm. You don't defend yourself and your right. family, you're a sissy. That's what they'll say. That makes sense to a man. Right. Mm -hmm. But the spirit will cause you to, 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 to flee and leave your wife. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Many saints had to do that. Amen. Yes, Lord. They had Stephen ready to stone Stephen to death. And there were no saints there to defend them. That's right. Because That's we right. don't defend. That's right. Yes, sir. Amen. James lost his head. No saint there to defend them. That's right. Men and children was was yeah. was 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 uh, 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 put to death, mm -hmm. fed to lions and yeah. dogs and all that. Yeah. Saints couldn't fight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now this don't make no sense to the world. Right. Yes. Oh, yes. He always will go against everything, against our nature. Yeah, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. He was saying that even, uh, 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 Brother Robert said, even animals would defend their child. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Or their right. little ones. Right, right. We would do the same thing if we were in the flesh. Yes, sir. But oh, yeah. we're not in the flesh. Not in the flesh. I, so we don't run to the school and jump on the teacher. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. Because your child come back and say, "My Miss William always hollering at me." We are wise. You say, "Well, boy, I'll holler at you because you don't listen." Miss <laughs> 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 William ain't doing no more than what you be doing. That's you right. know you win. We know our kids. Yeah, well, yeah. Uh -huh. I was yes, just as bad as two left right. shoes. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna sit down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't go to school to study. Mm -hmm. I went to school to be a joker. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. I went to yeah. school for PE. Oh, yeah. uh -huh. uh -huh. And for the free lunch I got every day. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's why I went to school. <laughs> I didn't go to school to learn. I didn't want to learn. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's why I don't know how to spell a day, because I didn't want to learn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If I could take seven classes of PE, I would be happy. <laughs> I even told the teacher, well, I got to learn about George Washington, Abraham Lincoln. They dead. They can't do nothing for me. <laughs> I told the teacher that. Why do I got to learn about history? <laughs> I would say that. Why do I got to learn about history? They don't know anything about no microwave. <laughs> just stupid. You know, just don't, just, just, that's how it was. Amen. And so when I was in one day, I was in the class, and and there was one girl there, my classmate, she didn't care too much about me, because I, I guess because I picked on her all the time. <laughs> and so she didn't like, because I, I, it was running my family. We talk about everybody. <laughs> it runs in our family. We're going to talk about you. Something wrong with your nose, we're going we gonna, we gonna to talk about your nose. Back in them days, we didn't get people named like lip eye for nothing. <laughs> there was something wrong with the lip and the eye. That's why we gave it to them. <laughs> we didn't call her stinky for nothing. <laughs> we grow one, we call her stinky. We ain't got it because she smelled like flowers. Oh, no. <laughs> so we've just, so, and one day in the, in the school, and, and, uh, and um, the teacher finally called me to do something. I was happy. Uh, Junebug, come up here. You want you pass the papers out? And I was shocked. <laughs> Me, pass out papers? I don't listen. I went to pass out the paper, and I came to the and I was going by. You know, calling that they was. He came up, and when I came by, this young my classmate said, "I want my give, give me my paper." I said, "What did I get to?" <laughs> and I said that she slapped me by my hands. So I, I slapped her back. <laughs> So when she, I hit her back. And I did that. She, when she pinched me, and I reached and I pinched her. 
And I peeped up when she hollered, and the teacher recognized that I, I did something. Holly, what did you do? I said, she pinched me first. <laughs> My mama told me if someone hit me to hit them back. <laughs> you go to the office. <laughs> she going to? <laughs> she didn't do it. I said, yes, she did. What she pinched her right there? Because she was crying, she wanted to know why I pinched her. Well, it don't look like she been pinched she white. I'm black. <laughs> You go to the office right now. I said, all right, Miss Boomerang. Because her face went just like oh this. Oh, my Lord. Oh. All right, Miss Boomerang. Oh, oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. So I go on down to the office down there. I'm in, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm in middle school now. I'm grown. I'm not in elementary. I'm in middle school. <laughs> I don't, I don't even ride the bus. I walk to school now. I'm old enough to walk. I'm old enough not to catch the bus. I can walk to school. I can cross 36 and not get hit. Highway 36 and not get hit. I'm, 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 I'm a big boy. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in the big school. I get to the principal office. The teacher say everything I tell, tell, tell the, the principal everything I did, and, and he says you gonna get three licks. I say I ain't getting nothing. She ain't hit me. See, she hit me. If I, if I get three licks, she gonna get three licks too. <laughs> Principal looked at her and said, let me see your arm. She, he showed her. She showed her his, uh, her arm. And he, and he, and he, and he said, what did she peach at her right here? They don't look like you didn't peach. I, I tell you, like I told her, she's white. <laughs> she said, well, you gonna get three licks. I said, I'm not getting no three licks. <laughs> Teacher left out and the little girl with her, my classmate, she left out. And he went to lock that door. So when he turned, I said, you ain't, something, you ain't locking me in here with you. <laughs> so when he went to lock that door, I snuck behind him and threw him over. <laughs> he fell over there, and I unlocked the door and ran. Took run. I ran. I was getting away. I was happy. I was running home. He can't catch me. I'm fast. <laughs> I'm, I'm the fastest kid in school. <laughs> but when the clothes I got to my grandmama house, uh-oh, oh, oh, wait a minute. Hey, grandma, <laughs> grandma don't play. So grandma know how bad I am. <laughs> now my mama is different. So I, and I was pacing back and forth. What I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna do? Cause grandma, my grandma was she gonna? I don't know what I'm gonna do. I took my fist and hit myself in the head real hard. <laughs> Put a knot up there. I put a knot on my head. I did. Real hard. It had to look real. It had to be real. I couldn't go home to my mama. He hit me. And there's nothing no proof. Like my mama's going to say, I don't see nothing there, boy. Same thing the principal said. Y'all got to make this count. This got to work. Because I know grandma, she put your head between her leg and lock it. And with that stench of car, big mama didn't play. So I went home, one night, howling, hollering, crying. I had my, I had, I had my act on. She said, "What are you doing here?" I said, "The principal pushed me down and hit my head." <laughs> my granddad said, "Where my gun? Where my gun?" <laughs> you don't miss a granddaddy neither. I mean, you want him on your side if he's mad. <laughs> They contact my mama, she Willaroo, she showed her. Oh, she she gone crazy now. Everybody, I got everybody on my side. So we go back to the school. We go back to the school. That wasn't the plan. So we go back to the school. Back to the school. Mama told granddaddy, you leave the gun, you can't take the gun. Arthur, you can't take that gun up to no school. That boy, that man, that old man hit my grandson. Don't hit my grandson. They was all, my mom's already, already mad. She's mad. So we go into the school and they, where he at? They talking loud, <laughs> mama. Where he at? So the principal trying to get them calm down, calm down, trying to explain to them. Finally got us all in the office. Spencer was trying to explain to them what had happened. And they didn't want to hear none of it. All they see that knot on my head. And the man said, I didn't push him down. He pushed me. I said, no, you, 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 
I, when I went to try to go out, you wouldn't let me out making enough stuff out as I was going. You wouldn't let me out. And so that's why I did that. When you did that, you did that. And he said, well, maybe I did it, but I don't, I don't see it happening like that. I'm the one failed. And he's brother, he can't come back unless he gets some licks. I stand on that. My mama said, take off your belt, boy. Back in them days, we had them big old cowboys, you know, <laughs> belt buckles. What's going on? That's not my plan. <laughs> what, 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 what? Take your belt off. This is my mama. Oh, so I took my belt off. They give it to me. Now I give it to I'm going to get a lick from the principal, and now I'm going to get a woman from my mom. My mama took that belt and wrapped it up and had that book hanging. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. I'm going to die now. <laughs> So my mama said, all right, go ahead and give him three licks. Hit him in a way that I don't like. <laughs> Hit him in a way that I don't like. <laughs> you say he can't come back unless he get three licks? Hit him in a way that I don't like. it. Get the three licks. Bend over. I've been over. He goes, pop, look at him. <laughs> I went on back to my class. But they know how bad I am. They should have stood against me, not with me. <laughs> right. mm -hmm. mm. Gay, gay, you only got in trouble when you were with me, right? Ray, Ray, where are you? You only got in trouble when you were with who? No, Uncle William Earl. No, Uncle Ken Wayne. No, with your sisters. Me? I was a bad creature. <laughs> bad creature. I was a bad seed. I didn't move a bad seed. That was me. <laughs> I killed your cat and dog and everything else. Yeah. <laughs> That's my testimony. The Lord delivered me from that. See, y'all, we can get the worst sinners and clean us up if we believe. Yeah, yes, can. Come on, verse, and let's get through. Neither can he know them because they are spiritually They can't get discerned. this because they are spirit. spiritually You've got to be in the spirit to receive the spirit. Yes, or else sir. it's just not going to make no sense to you. Yes, sir. Our message don't make no sense to people who not, don't have the spirit of God mm -hmm. and don't even have the love of God. Mm -hmm. So we say to our listeners, you come on and do this thing for yourself. Mm -hmm. Don't wait on nobody. Right. This thing will make a new creature. Yes, it will. You hear our testimony, you find out that Yahweh have brought all of us. Mm -hmm. We were some bad people in the world. Yes, sir. We were very wicked in the world. Yes, sir. Sister Sylvia, your cousin, your sister, or aunt, mm -hmm. or whatever she is. Mm -hmm. She was a bad woman in the world. Mm -hmm. So now she's someone new. And you can be new too, just believe the report. Amen. See, now she's a sucra. She's someone that mm -hmm. she's been a blessing ever since she's been here in this ministry. Yes, a blessing. Yes, sir. So we thank Yahweh for the words that He've given unto us tonight. Let's take the words of Yahweh. Let's apply it to our life. Let's be strong. Let's keep the faith. May Yahweh bless each of you. May Yahweh keep you. Pastor Jenkins. Let us all receive Pastor Jingle by saying praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh.